Hello. I'm good. Oh, sick of it. Well, now, no, now that the shot, I guess it's time for me to do another shot. And now it's starting to go off. But it has been two. Yeah. Got my prescription. It's Vlogmas Day. What? Thank you, Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to if you're new. I actually have a lot to catch you guys up on. I lost a lot of my footage from yesterday. Woosa, woosa. We're not even going to talk about it, but I'm just going to basically update you guys on what's been going on and then we can get into today's part of the vlog. So yesterday would technically be Vlogmas Day 1. So that makes today Vlogmas Day 2. I'm just going to recap everything that happened. The day before yesterday, which was Monday, I had an extremely busy, busy, busy day. I recorded a couple of clips here and there, but it was just too hectic, too much stuff going on for me to record like a whole sit down talking process like I'm doing right now monday i woke up i actually finished editing my come to work with me video went to a couple of thrift stores filmed a video on that if you guys haven't already went to go check that out make sure to click the link in the eye above here then after that around three o'clock i had an OBGYN appointment basically that appointment was just to discuss my birth control options you girl i don't know if you've been keeping up then you know i don't talk about it too too much but i had to get off that depo shot okay i've been bleeding for like four months straight and it nothing was working all the recommendations they said wasn't cutting it and i my attitude was out the roof i had to get that out the door so i went there and i got my second no actually this will be my third form of birth control and i end up getting the patch i'm gonna show you guys that in a little minute but before all of that i told you guys my appointment was at three i ended up leaving the house around like two my mom was watching tink because before i went to my doctor's appointment i stopped at her doctor's office i had to get her formula prescription filled out because i went to the wick office and they were <laughs> Stop shoving it down your throat. Because I went to the WIC office and they said that her formula prescription is expiring since she does have Neutrimogen that I guess that needs a prescription. So, but I've been calling and calling. I've called like three times. They called me back the first time, but I missed the call and then I called again. All three times I left a voicemail, no call back. I went up there and took them the paper and had them physically fill it out. No facts for now since y'all wanna take so long. So I ended up going to Tink's doctor's appointment first since my doctor couldn't sign the paper right away. My OBGYN office was right up the street so I went to my appointment at three. When I got out, I still had a little bit of time left. The form wasn't done. So I went Christmas shopping at five and below. Thank you. How stinking cute. Welcome to the North Pole Santa shop in the buggy. And I want you. Can I take this card outside? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. 
your girl was super excited this year for Christmas, especially because this is Tink's first Christmas. You know, your girl had to do a little a little festivities, okay? And I've also did some pre-shopping at like Dollar Tree and stuff. shopping so i went to five and below yesterday and then a couple of days prior i went to dollar tree so after i came from five and below i got me some food from panda express i didn't record any of that but i went straight to her doctor's office and i picked up her paper it was around like 4 30 at the time and the week office closed at five so i had to rest over to the week office to hurry up and drop off that paper your girl made it okay i made it so that was monday and then yesterday, I gave you guys a little haul of all of the Christmas decor that I've bought so far. <laughs> okay, so really quick, I wanted to give you guys a haul of all the Christmas decor that I brought in the past couple of days. So first place I'm going to show you guys is Dollar Tree. So I actually went to a couple of different Dollar Trees. This one in particular, I just got two towels for the kitchen. It says, have yourself a merry little Christmas super cute with the red fire truck you guys will see why i got this design in a little while you just stuff both of that in your mouth why you did that acting like a chipmunk and then off topic but i just got a black ice air freshener for my car next we're gonna do hobby lobby if you guys watched my treating myself video then you guys would have already seen these items so first thing i got is this advent calendar I don't know you guys, this was just the one for me. They had a lot of different options. This was the one that I chose. It says countdown to Christmas. Just move this little reef right here from the days. Super cute. So we gotta hurry up and put this up so we can include it in today because this is part of the weekly vlog. And then last but not least, I got this mug. How many times we're gonna say cute? I don't know, but it is cute. Got the black Santa, okay. It's gonna give aesthetic vibes. Y'all gonna see this in use a lot. Next, we got Five and Below. We got the Christmas PJs. I got a size of medium. These were the last ones. All the rest are like extra larges and stuff. But they just have these cute little elves on them, Christmas presents. Just giving the vibe. I got my Christmas PJs on now. Just some cute little poppers, penguins, okay but i'm definitely loving the pink in these ones so i can't wear to rock them in the vlog we got this pillow it says holly jolly with a little embroidered candy cane and then on the back it has this super cute design this is really why i bought it i wish they would have had two of them but this was the last one they were literally all out of the holiday pillows that i seen last time before i actually went christmas shopping so i should have picked it up then i know i know i beat myself in the head okay i got this little cup i seen it at hobby lobby and it was a more expensive price and i was like i know i can find it somewhere else for cheaper that was my little excuse to purchase it <laughs> y'all look at her outfit isn't it so cute she got her little bow say red bow green bow i didn't feel like changing the bead so we rocking the blue bead this little outfit from carter's and then she got on the long socks with the bows. Those is from Timu. What a cutesy baby, cutesy baby. You can go crawl around and be free real quick. One of my big purchases, also from Five and Below, only $5. I got this yard sign. It says, Welcome North Pole Santa Shop. Cute little direction sign pointing here and there. I forgot about this. This is more Five and Below items. Isn't this so cute, you guys? It says, Joy. It has the little leaves and what are those little cranberries or something. I'm not going to be able to put it outside today because it is raining pretty bad and I don't want to mess it up already. So another trip to Five and Below. Do you see why I needed two pillows? Your girl got the matching blanket. This is the cutest pattern ever. I don't know. Got some fluffy socks just because I needed some more. Got some snowflakes on this one. A plain white or cream 
and then some stripes and last but not least i got this bulb for a photo shoot coming up you know tink's gonna be turning nine months pretty soon christmas is coming up lots of photo opportunities so y'all just stay tuned for what i'm gonna use this for found what i was looking for my last dollar tree item so first off I got two pack of these bowls. They both got the red fire truck, got the snowflakes, the green. Okay, so I got two packs of these, so that's four. More, more, more matching. You were always eating something. I actually was looking for another roll of this here ribbon, but I've been to like three Dollar Trees and all of them don't have any. And the first one I went to only had just this one. So if I would have known that, I would have picked a whole nother thing, but. Thank you. How are you mad? Cause you're eating paper. Uh-uh, you definitely can't eat that. Here, get a doodle. Okay, let me just show them the last few things, okay, team? This, it says a glitter drape, but it's basically like little fake snow and it has kind of green and red glitters in there. So that's what I was gonna use this for. Two packs of giant Santa hat chair covers. Look how cute this is. I don't know, I'm ready to start decorating. Let's get decorated. So I lied. One more bag. I told you your girl went a little crazy this year. Got two packs of this felt. I got two packs of this felt uh, icicle fringe. It's basically like, you know, fake dripping snow. The old famous red truck with the Christmas tree on top, carrying the Christmas tree. Got the star on the hood. It says Merry Christmas. All of this from Dollar Tree, like, I don't know. They give it. And finally, last but not least, I got just this little house. Has the reefs, the chimney. And yeah, okay, let me hurry up because Teak fussing. Um, so I did a little Christmas shopping, I did a haul, and then I started Christmas decorating. So it's actually around two o'clock, and my mom gets home at three, and I'm supposed to be dropping off the postcards at the post office. So I need to go ahead and sign these really quick before I do any decorating. I posted on my community tab. If you follow me on Instagram and send me your name and your address. I will be shipping off the Halloween poster cards that I got made of Sunny. So I need to sign these really quick and then we can get to decorating. So here's the cards that I was talking about. If you guys haven't seen the vlog where I showed you guys where these are from, I'll have it linked in my bio. So I'm gonna just go ahead and sign them right here. I got all of them signed and then I got them paired with their matching card. Each person gets two cards, one that's signed and then one just for special keepsakes. I've already wrote all the addresses on all the envelopes from OK Leah, silly face, period. So I'm gonna go ahead and package these up so they'll be ready to get shipped off.
is coming out super duper cute like i said so far yesterday tink interrupted me and she had a huge and when i mean huge i mean huge blowout it was all over her toys her blanket her crib sheet her clothes it was everywhere all right you guys so i was decorating tink started crying and when i came in here she had a huge blowout you guys like ah don't be moving everywhere hold on look y'all got all on her blanket and in her crib got all on her shocks and on her outfit so i was finna change her i was finna change her but honestly it's about time for a bath so i'm just gonna give her a bath so it's gonna have to be a hold on the christmas decorating sorry y'all we'll get back to it sooner or later i ended up just giving her a bath rather than just like changing her diaper and all that stuff and she just playing having a good time acting like nothing happened <laughs> And just like that, a brand new sheet. I did all the laundry, you know, washed all the poopiness away. And after that, I was like low-key kind of over it. So I never finished decorating. We gonna start part two of the decorating today. Hopefully we can get it all done. I'm just super excited to see how it all comes together. If you guys are new to this channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe right down below. It's big and red and it's free. You can't miss it and it helps your girl out. Follow me on all my social medias. They'll be on the screen and in the description box down below. If you're ready for Vlogmas, just keep watching because your girl is coming with the content. All right, y'all. So it is currently, what, 10 o'clock. I just put Tink in her crib. So the mantle right here is literally all I got to decorate yesterday. I didn't even get to finish putting up the stockings. So I'm finna finish decorating before we head out. Look how cute is our stockings, personalized. If you guys haven't already seen the video where I showed you guys me unboxing this, it'll be linked in the eye above. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. So Tink just woke up from her nap. She's right down here playing. I told you guys earlier I was going to show you what birth control I decided to go with. So I got, what is it? I don't even know how to pronounce it. I just know it's the patch. It's called the patch. It comes in like a little pack just like this. And you just stick it on your body somewhere, anywhere, anywhere but your chest. And it's supposed to... Uh, stop pregnancy. <laughs> I did end up applying this yesterday to my lower back region.
but in the beginning i was really scared i had went in there wanting the pills but then i saw this option and i felt like it would be a lot more like healthier for my body so i went ahead with this one without doing like the research and stuff and as soon as i got home i did my little research <laughs> on TikTok Academy, it kind of scared me, you guys. A lot of people were having bad experience with this. It was either making them lose or gain weight. Their periods just got heavier. They were vomiting and like throwing up all the first day or like the first week or something like that. Couldn't eat, like felt fatigue. And I was just like, oh Lord, like what did I get myself into? I should've just went with the pills. But I did end up putting it on yesterday and honestly, I feel perfect. I don't know if it just hasn't started working yet or if this one is just taking good to my body. But so far, this is the best method. All right, y'all. So now that Tink is up, your girl is ready. But it's time to get Tink ready to go. But before we do that, it is officially Vlogmas Day 2. So we got to go ahead and start updating the advent calendar. Like, what is we doing? I ain't buying for no reason. Come on, y'all. girl feel like i don't know tis the season halloween wasn't really the vibe to be honest so i did a lot of things that i enjoyed like i went to the pumpkin patch i went to the fair and a, like a bunch of other things and that kind of made me feel like in the fall spirit not more so halloween christmas is your girl's season okay with that being said today is wednesday thanksgiving eve it's like 12 30 ish me and tink are on the way to best buy oh my gosh y'all it's so surreal to think what i'm about to do right now <sighs> y'all know your girls on the road to 20k subscribers right like let me just give myself a pat on the back but i think it's time i really truly think it's time to get off of this iphone i don't know black friday's coming up they got like a ton of deals on ipads and cameras that i've been looking at and i think i'm just gonna go ahead and break the bank so to say and buy myself a vlogging camera a camera a camera i've been so hesitant to buy a camera this whole time just because y'all love the way i edit videos but i've only like trained myself to edit on my phone and i've only trained myself to film and record on my phone so when it comes to cameras i really don't know how to work cameras i didn't want to pay all this money for something and don't even know how to use it your girl's not tech savvy same with computers editing on a computer sounds scary to me i'm used to this tap screen that's why i'm getting an ipad <sighs> oh yeah i'm getting the ipad <laughs> my first big girl purchase of my whole life i've never bought my phone like always been gifts on christmas or something that's what i'll ask for i didn't buy my car my car was gifted to me it was gifted to me but she uh i still make payments on it it wasn't paid off but like she started paying it and then when i turned 18 she gave it to me other than like bills and stuff expensive designer purse no me going out and buying uh some shoes no me going out and buying technology no so like this is my first ever big girl purchase i don't know i'm just thinking of it as a tax write-off okay okay this is for the business this is an investment in myself because i believe in myself i've come this far tink then kicked off her shoe y'all look at her i always say look at her and then in the video y'all can never see what you want your passy oh the light turned green tink there you go you just feel you just know where your baby mouth at <laughs> but like i was saying best buy has both of the items that i want on a deal for black friday the camera i'm looking at the sony zv 1f i think it is but that camera is purposely for vlogging i've did my research on it it's a great content creator's camera for a beginner it's normally like 500 to 600 dollars range but right now it's 399 and then there's an ipad that i'm looking at i think it's the 10.2 inch and they're on sale as well for like 4.99 they're on sale right now for Black Friday. And like I told you guys, today is Thanksgiving Eve and they will be closed on Thanksgiving. And to be honest, I really didn't want to bring Sonny out on Black Friday. Honestly 
honestly i do miss black friday shopping when i was younger like it gave me a thrill okay so i really would like to go black friday shopping but that just doesn't seem realistic with a baby i don't want it to go off sale or sell out or something like that and i don't get it so i'm just gonna go ahead and make the purchase today but i just want to say thank you to you guys without y'all i would have no reason to purchase this camera i wouldn't have the funds to purchase this camera i appreciate all the love and support that i do get i appreciate the hate that i get too because they still bring me queens so keep liking keep commenting keep sharing the channel so we can grow y'all gonna get sick of seeing me in this curly wig but like to be honest it's so mommy friendly like, I never glue it down. I always just stick it on my head and I'm out the door. Nowadays, sign it on, let me get ready. So, this is just the most convenient way. So, y'all probably gonna see it a lot. Okay, get used to it. It's a quick, easy, look good wig, period. Best Buy. I got a specific iPad and camera in mind that I'm looking for, but I'm also going to see if they have more options, maybe like a better deal for a better quality camera. But for the iPad, I'm pretty locked on what I'm looking for. I've never come to Best Buy, so I honestly don't know where none of this stuff is at. But these ones look like the big ones. Oh no, it's on the other side. Hold on. So these are the big priced ones. See, oh, I ain't know it worked. I ain't ready for all of that now. See, this is stuff I'm really gonna be confused. Let me go on the other side. Oh, wait, this one's actually recording. You can see the quality a little bit. So this one was actually the one that I was looking at right here. See, I had it right. ZV-1F vlog camera, literally says for content creators. Comes with the mic and everything and it has the flip screen for you to see yourself. I don't know if all the cameras would just be in one area. So how would I look for the best bargain? Like I said, I never come to Best Buy. Uh-oh, my blanket came off. Look at Ting. Oh, that's why I didn't want this one because it's mirrorless. Yeah, no. So it looks like you can do payment plans on this camera. It's going to be $33.34, but honestly, I was planning on cashing out on the camera and doing payment plans on the iPad, but we'll see. Yeah, this is the iPad, $349. Camera, the speakers, Can you see the back? Pretty cool. This one still has Pro. the home button. We used to have it over here. For two forty nine. Um, that one starts at the point two eight. Can't use it for a So it's pointless. Um, all right, y'all, so I think this is the one I'm actually going to end up getting just because it's like a better investment. This lens. You see how it's able to zoom out? This one doesn't do that. So I would like to actually be able to use this camera for a while and get a lot of uses out of it and not have to constantly upgrade. So this is the one I'm most likely gonna end up getting. And then I'm gonna get the iPad. It's on sale for $349, but I'm just gonna pay that like completely off. I showed you guys the iPad I was getting already. So, yeah, I'm super excited. Y'all look at it. Period. I don't think so. OMG, y'all, look! Your girl is an official camera owner, okay? Cause period. This is the 
this is the camera i ended up going with the sony digital zv1 i felt like this would be a better investment and i had to extend the lens just for you guys to see my iphone so i got the color blue as you guys can see well actually i'm not gonna open it i'm gonna do a full unboxing i don't know if i'm gonna include it in this vlogmas or if i'm gonna make it a separate video i did not know it was this big like obviously when i went in and i seen the display i known but like from online your girl really upgraded uh I made it back home and I just wanted to show you guys another close up. Like I paid all this money for and I'm finna show it all. So here is my iPad. It says 64 gigabytes. And then I got it in the color blue. And then I actually ended up going with a different camera. I'm a little sick to my stomach because I spent just about a band in Best Buy. And I didn't mean to spend that much. Right after I bought it in the parking lot, I was sitting here researching like cheaper prices for this camera or like better quality cameras for like a cheaper price. And I'm just, no, no, no. You brought this camera to invest in yourself, okay? So this is gonna last us a while and I won't have to keep replacing cameras, create better content and, you know, make more money with the item, you know? $649.99, it was $100 off on sale. So with tax, I paid $698.74. And honestly, I didn't know I paid that. I'm just proud of myself, you guys. Like, I would have never thought I would have never thought. I've come so far. I've, I've come so far. But yeah, we made it home. Sonny is back there sleeping. I'm gonna go inside, put her inside. Hopefully she stays asleep and takes a nap and your girl can do what she got to do. y'all so it is 5 35 and your girl is back at dollar tree her favorite place in the world that ribbon and the bows i brought earlier from dollar tree these ribbons right here that i brought from dollar tree earlier just weren't giving it just wasn't giving the vibe that i expected so and then plus i can't find any more of that ribbon and i ran out and only did like two cabinets instead of buying a whole bunch of ribbon maybe i'll try this hair tassel and then get some bows to go with it. I actually think I'm gonna go with this bow right here because it's kind of the only one that matches this red vibe. This one is not gonna give, I don't know about the black in the kitchen and then the glitter. This may be my best option right here.
Good morning, everybody, and happy Thanksgiving. So happy Thanksgiving, Tink. Today is Thanksgiving. I just got finished. I just got finished prepping the turkey. I seasoned it real nice, hopefully. I put some butter on the inside. We injected it with some goodness. This is your girl's first time making the turkey for Thanksgiving. So y'all comment down below how I did, what you would change, what seasonings y'all use. I just use what we had at the house, to be honest. Me and Tink are up for the morning. We've actually been up for a little while. I thought she was gonna go back to sleep. She woke up at like 5.30. We are being productive today. We are in the kitchen. I'm about to finish decorating today because it's gone on far enough and I'm just ready to be fully in the Christmas spirit. I was running into this problem where for one, I couldn't find any more of this ribbon. There was literally only one at the Dollar Tree. And then plus the tape just wasn't holding it. Like it's falling off. So we're gonna take this down. But first, before we do that, we gotta go move the advent calendar. Okay, we are now on day. This is easily becoming my favorite part of the day, like. like a early christmas it is so gorgeous i love the color as y'all can see look at the detailing on the power button that apple logo iconic and it just looks so sleek you guys
So it is currently 3.30. As y'all can see behind me, all of the food is done. Me and Tink are dressed. Look at her cute little outfit. Got the Burberry skirt. Fake Uggs, fake Burberry. Period, she's so cute. I tried to take some pictures. She wasn't really cooperating, but I'm gonna make our plate. Yes, I said our plate. Cause Tink will be enjoying something this Thanksgiving, huh? Cause she sure been fussing, so maybe she hungry. So here's the final plate. I don't know, y'all. I think I did good for what I had. We got the cornbread, the turkey, mashed potatoes and gravy, macaroni, greens, and then we even got Tink a little Thanksgiving dinner. Um, it's a nine months plus, but she's almost nine months. She'll be nine months on the ninth. So the doctor also recommended me to uh, start feeding her meats. So. This is the Earth's Best Organics brand, the chicken pot pie. Hopefully she enjoys that. Your girl has a huge family. And when I say huge, I mean huge. And all of us are like all over the place. We got family in just about every city, every state. So it's kind of hard for us all to get together during Thanksgiving because like some people can't get off. Some people don't have the money to fly. You know, don't have people to watch the kids, whatever it is. Um, most of my family don't live here in Florida with me. So normally for Thanksgiving, it's just me and my mom. But this year we got Sunny and we still really didn't cook nothing big. We, we didn't go all out, you know, do the homemade version. I still like, I put a twist. She ready to eat, y'all. We finna eat. I looked up a couple of recipes on YouTube on how to like spice up box macaroni and how to cook a turkey. So here's the person's video I followed. If you guys are interested for the turkey, it says easy bake turkey recipe, um, island vibe cooking. And then here is the recipe I used for the macaroni. This young man's name right here says top winning Southern baked macaroni. Yeah, shout out to them. But yeah, I just did my best to work with what we had. There's no point in going out and buying all these expensive ingredients to make this like big old family dinner if it's only going to be the two of us. And honestly, my mom's at work right now. So right now it's just me and Tink. Yeah, like I said, we were just making do with what we had. So I'm okay with about macaroni. I'm not bougie, it's low key kind of good to me. So I'm going to enjoy my plate. <laughs>
Y'all look at Ting. So cute, Mama Ting. Good morning, everybody. Today is Vlogmas Day 4. It's actually Black Friday, and me and Ting, as you can see, are out and about. We're on our way to Walmart because Walmart has this Black Friday sale on a ring line. I believe it's like a 16 inch, and it's on sale for 25. I recently just brought this big old 18 inch and i am taking that back y'all that was 50 dollars and this one is a couple of inches smaller but i feel like it would be more practical because this one is just like too big honestly this wasn't even the one that i wanted i wanted the 16 inch from the jump and they didn't have any more 16s at the time which i see why i guess they were holding them for black friday and so i just went ahead and went with this one but this one is just way way too big it's constantly leaning over because the bottom's not sturdy enough to support the top if i'm trying to like angle a clip or the ring light itself is just too big so as i'm um walking and carrying it i'm hitting it on the doorway ceiling or wherever wherever i'm hitting it on and i'm gonna end up damaging it so i'm just gonna go ahead and take it back also i wanted to start filming with my camera but yesterday at best buy it was just so much going on that I wasn't even thinking about like all the camera supplies that I was supposed to buy with it. Before I got there, I had a down pack. Like I'm like, okay, I need a battery pack, a battery charger, SIM card, all of this stuff. And then I get there and I guess the, the price that I ended up paying kind of shook me a little bit. I wasn't going in there expecting to pay that. It already came with a battery pack, so um, hopefully that's charged up. The whole reason I got it is so I can film more for Vlogmas because I'm so limited on how much I can film filming on my phone. My storage is constantly running out. I just got to show y'all real quick how cute Sonny look. I don't think y'all going to be able to see her. She back there choking. Dang. Got that passy in your mouth. This outfit is so cute. I actually gotta do a haul when I get home on all the clothes that Millioli sent me. I've worked with them before in the past and I absolutely love their baby clothing. So I wanted to show you guys what I got sent for the holiday season. I really did all of my Black Friday shopping. I guess like almost all the stores are starting to do Black Friday the whole month of November because they're starting a lot earlier than just regular Black Friday. And I also purchased Sony a tablet for in the car or just at the house or whatever, a little kid's tablet on Walmart, but it's only online. So I ordered that, it actually came in. I wanna show you guys when I get home. All right, you guys, so it's days later and I realized I never showed you Tink's tablet. I told you I brought from Walmart on Black Friday. This is the brand Contixo Kids. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but it's a seven inch kids tablet. This is what it looks like. It was on sale for $39.99. I had to order off the Walmart website. They didn't have this one in stores. 32 gigabytes and it says, 50 disney ebooks included so like i said that was one of the reasons why i purchased this tablet because it already had a lot of the kids stuff downloaded on it all the other ones were just like basic tablets so i felt like this was very age appropriate for her so this is what the back looks like i'm not going to open the box up this is a christmas gift so i want it to stay brand new in the box but I still wanted to show you guys because this was a good find. Okay, so I end up just sliding the packaging off. Still, technically, it didn't take it out the box. But just so you guys can see an up-close view of what it would look like. Like I said, this is the brand right here. So cute. I haven't opened it yet because like I said, it is for Christmas. I want to wrap it up. It's $39.99 and it came with the case and everything. I got a cute pink case. It comes with all like kids apps downloaded on it, so... I got that for her. I never told you guys how my food turned out yesterday. So this was my first time cooking Thanksgiving. This year it was just me and Sonic because my mom had to work. So I just decided to whip up a cool little meal with what we had in the house. And low key, it turned out pretty decent. Only thing I have to say is my macaroni and cheese. It was a little dry. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie to you guys. It was a little dry. I don't know what the problem was. I followed the recipe that I showed you guys. Only thing I didn't do that she did was add milk right before I put it in the oven because hers looked it a little bit more thicker than mine. Mine already looked it watery. So I didn't want to add any because I had already added milk when I was stirring. Either that was the case, I didn't add as much milk as I was supposed to or I left it in there too long. I was trying to like, 
you know how when you when you look at baked macaroni the top be all nice and crispy and a like brownish golden color that's what i was waiting on never really got to that color so maybe i kept it in there too long the flavor was still good it just wasn't cheesy everything else bomb turkey bomb mashed potatoes bomb but i ain't even gonna do i ain't even gonna do too much on myself because everybody can't make mac and cheese everybody can't bring the mac and cheese to thanksgiving and that's just i just accepted that i can't bring the mac and cheese it's okay it's cool with me let's cook and i gotta do Y'all, I just see this sitting here, and I guess like in a pile of go bags. Oh, but whatever type of toy this is, this will be a great toy, like a great Christmas gift. Let me take a picture of this. All right, y'all, so we in the camera section, Tink Fussing. They don't have the 18 inch ring light for 25 like the other Walmart, but they do have the ring light I already have. This is the ring light I already have. It's the 18 inch and they're on sale for 15. So I may just return mine and then, <laughs> why are you fussing? I may just return mine and then rebuy that one for 15, but I really just didn't want this size, you guys. This, this is like a big size. It'd be getting in the way of a lot of things. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. I left your snacks in the car by accident. <laughs> I'm sorry. And then here are the SD card options. I ended up picking this SunDisk one. It's 128 gigabytes. Hopefully this is compatible with my camera. They had a 256 gigabyte one. I didn't even see this one, but this was only $18.98. So I, I think this is good to start off with. Why are you screaming? Hey. 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 Why are you screaming? Stop. <laughs> uh uh. That's dirty. Alright, y'all. So I'm finna unbox the ring light that I just bought. So we can start this haul video. Thank you. Check it out. All right, y'all, so we are back home and we're gonna film this clothing haul I promised you guys earlier. Millie only sent over a ton of goodies for Sonny Poo. <laughs> The outfit she was already wearing today is from them. They are a kid clothing brand. They have a lot of unique pieces that you wouldn't find at regular stores, including like Walmart and Target. And I've worked with them before. You guys know how much I love their clothing. If you guys do end up liking any of the clothes that you see in today's haul, I'll have a coupon code on the screen. A dash YT gets you 20% off of your purchase. If you go over there and you find something that you like for your little one, they have tons of different options, different styles. So they have something over there for your liking. All of her clothes I got in the 12 months because they don't do six to nine. So everything is six to 12. But here is the first Aww. outfit. Super cute. I love the brown on brown skin. It did come as a two piece. As y'all can see, it has this little knitting design on it. Got the wooden buttons. And then here is the pants to go with it. A white little drawstring for if they're a little too big for when you get them. Say it's super cute. She's been wearing this all day. We got tons of compliments, huh? My little baby doll. <laughs> This one is so cute. So here is the next outfit. <laughs> 
again another two-piece set we got rudolph Ooh. the red nose some other reindeers on the shirt i'm loving this waffle cone print i'm i don't know really what it's called i love like shirts with textures then it came with these green sweatpants <laughs> Like I said, it was a two-piece set, so it comes with these super cute green sweatpants. It's given like a little mint green color. This is one of the outfits that I was waiting on, cause just look how cute. This one is selling fast, you guys. I barely got it, so if you want it, go get it while it's in stock. So here's the next piece that we have. I didn't want to put this on her just, it's chilly, but it's a little toasty inside. And this is real thick knitted material. I love the little moon design. I believe I've seen like a designer, some type of designer have this print before. So I definitely had to pick this up. A button closure. Here go the buttons right here. So this is the inside right here. Like I said, it is a pretty thick material. So here is the next and final outfit. We got this, <laughs> this little bodysuit in the color like heather gray. It says New York on the front. It's low key giving like a baby hoodie. It's super cute. Like I said, it is just a one piece. So there's a button closure. <laughs> this isn't like that thick of a material if you guys are wanting sweatsuit material this is not that but it is still super cute for the look okay so we did start this collab around the halloween season so one of the free gifts that they had with the purchase was this super cute pumpkin headband i'm loving the velvet obviously it's like not the season for this now but they have Christmas stuff over there. They have cute Christmas head pieces and things like that. Definitely go give them a check out. And then one of the last pieces they sent me was this, this blow up pool. I'm super excited for this. This is another one of Tink's Christmas presents. Hopefully she ain't paying too much attention. Well, I know you guys are thinking like, why would you get a blow up pool for Christmas? I got some balls and we're gonna put the balls in it and she gonna have a ball pit, okay? She gonna have a good time. She probably just gonna eat them to be honest or throw them. She's real big on throwing right now. I'm gonna insert a picture of what it's supposed to look like on the screen. But if you guys stick around for more parts of Vlogmas, you'll see this in use pretty soon. We wanted to say thank you to Millioli for sending over these adorable baby clothes. Like I said, if you guys are interested and want to check out their brand, I'll have the link to all of these pieces in the description box below along with a link to their website and a coupon code on the screen to get you 20% off your purchase when you shop. I mean, just look at my cutie pie. What's up, y'all? It's been a little minute since I talked to you. It's almost 3 o'clock, and we on the road to drop your girl Sunny off. Every Friday, I drop Sunny off with her dad's. We are dropping her off a little early today per her dad's request. I'm not complaining. I did have her for Thanksgiving. That just gives me more time to get stuff done. I can go ahead and start editing this vlog right here, a vlog miss week one. I got a lot of cleaning to do, you guys. Sonny, um, now that we're food weaning, woo, there's like food everywhere. Smudged on the couch, smudged on her high chair. Everything gotta get scrubbed down. And then plus I just wanna do like a little, it's not spring cleaning, what would it be? winter cleaning for this upcoming season because you can't really get into the Christmas spirit when your house is a mess. Sonny is back here fussing. I don't know what for, but she fussing about something. Let me get rid of her shower bottle. Don't drop it. Mama Tinks was just hungry. Just want to clean up the kitchen and the living room area, but I've already cleaned Sonny's in my room before I left. I got that out of the way because I knew that was going to be a task. When I drop Sonny off before I head back home, I want to go ahead and and scoot to the mall. I heard Old Navy is having a Black Friday sale to where they have all of their Christmas PJs on sale for $5, the little matching family Christmas PJs. Y'all know I gotta go scoot me some. And for five dollars of course. Definitely gotta go pick up that deal. Then I'm gonna come home and get to cleaning. I did make her food for her dad. She got a variety of things today. Gave her some sweet potato pie. I know she's gonna enjoy this little bitty tree. Strawberry and applesauce. Bananas, there's some ravioli in there, blended up ravioli, mixed veggies, all that good stuff. So she got a lot of good things to eat over this weekend. I almost forgot low key, since I had to leave so early, I completely forgot.
God, I told him I was ready and everything. I was like, wait a minute, wait, hold on. Give me like 15 minutes, let me put something together. I wanna blend up her food as long as possible before I like start introducing her into processed food. If I got time to do it, I'm always gonna blend up her food and put some love into it. Are you gonna say bye bye? I've been trying to teach her how to wait. She don't be trying to. Say bye bye. <laughs> Look how she looking. She looks so lost. Okay, whatever, child. She like the little shit. That's what I'm saying. I got one, but she always pull it down. She don't pull yours off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm telling on you. looking for these y'all and they don't have her size
Happy Vlogmas Day 5, you guys. Good morning, good morning. I did not talk to you guys any yesterday. I really didn't do much yesterday. Yesterday was a chill day. I went to work like I am on the way now. Came home and I literally just relaxed. I didn't have, um, well I did have a couple of videos to edit. They don't need to be edited right away. I still have like a good amount of time in front before I need those to be uploaded. I didn't have to clean like I always do. I just really relaxed. Today's a new day. Today is Sunday, I'm headed to work. I may record a couple of clips at work. Um, not too much though, cause I am making a TikTok. If you guys wanna see like a full in depth, come work with me. I actually just uploaded one. It'll be linked in the eye above if you wanna go watch. But yeah, of course, Sundays is the day I gotta go pick up Sonny. So then after I get off, probably around like six. Don't mind this on my face. The pimple just popped up out of nowhere, okay? And it had like a, that nasty white head on it. And I just couldn't go to work looking like that. And I also didn't want to pop it. So I got this on. Hopefully, by the time I get there, it didn't do this little magic or whatever. But yeah, that's the little update today. Thank you. 